When you see women do it, it brought the violence to a whole other level. So why does switching who carries a blade change the felt sharpness of the scene? And what does that reveal about how reality itself depends on the frame of the observer? We think intensity belongs to the act itself, like mass belongs to a rock. Yet even energy isn't absolute. Kinetic energy depends on your motion. Stand still with a baseball and it's harmless. Meet it at 90 miles an hour and it's an impact. Our minds work the same way. We walk around with priors, expectations about who does what, and the sensation of force we feel in a scene is partly the collision between expectation and evidence. Neuroscience models the brain as a prediction engine. What grabs your attention is the prediction error, and the brain weights that error by its estimated precision. Change the performer, and you're not just changing casting, you're changing the probability distribution in the audience's head. That amplifies the error signal, recruiting different networks, and shifting moral appraisal faster than the dialogue can. In signal processing terms, your mind runs a matched filter for what people like this tend to do.